Hi my loves, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you see me for the first time, hi, I am Rada. If you're a regular, regular or a returning subscriber, you're welcome back, honey. So because you guys have been asking and pressuring me for so long to give you guys a house tour, especially that period when I was doing like my renovations and all that, I said, you know what? It is 2023 and the request from 2023, you're not taking them to 2024. So this is my house tour. Welcome to my house. First things first, I love my bed. This is my bed area. Literally, I love my bed because this is where I start my day. What is a good day or bad day and end my day here. And I really love my bed being just feeling cozy and comfortable and cute. That's why from here you can see the first thing that I love to do is place my white bed sheets on. I love white bed sheets. You guys, I think you've never seen me without white bed sheets ever because I love them. Like they make so much sense, they make the house bright because this is a small bed sitter house and a bed sitter is very small guys. So just making it very vibrant with the colors makes a lot of sense. Normally I put my duvet on but because I don't love the duvet being on during the day, I prefer to have the white sheets. Now from that area we can see this area. I love having many pillows. These are just but a few pillows guys. I would love to have as many pillows as possible. Because pillows just make sense. I sleep with one pillow, but I need to have like a million pillows. God get this, I know. So most of these things I got there from Kamukunji. And these throw pillows, guys, they are so cute. Let me just show you. These pillows, they are blue. They don't have the outer covers, the throw cases. But I can use them the way they are. That's how, you know, saving money works for me. So that's that area. And then now we come to this fleece. Now this fleece, you guys, you saw that I had a blue fleece, but then I changed to this one that is yellow. It is so beautiful because first of all, this one is a velvet one. I love just the lines that come with it. It is very good material, very good fabric. And I use it especially when I'm just resting or watching my movie when it's cold. And this is just basically it. I love everything about it. Starting my day there and then my day there. From my bed, that's where we come to my closet area, which is my favorite part. And I know most of you love this closet because when I bought it, you guys loved the transformation. But before the closet area, we have my Wi-Fi router. This makes so much sense to me when I'm filming, editing, and posting because having a Wi-Fi is good. I don't love what is put, like it is very exposed. I would love it to be changed. And also the wires are very exposed, but it just serves the purpose, right? It is very beautiful and I place my tripod right here when I'm just filming by myself. This is where I place it just for storage because I don't have much space. But then from there, this is where my closet is. This closet is the most beautiful thing of this house. Right? Right? <laughs> oh my god, but this is the most beautiful part of this house because it makes everything like be well positioned because this is where i place all the long stuff it's an open closet i just bought it it wasn't in this house and i place all my clothes right here you can see like the jackets my you know bathrooms are just here and it makes the storage easier for me and then this is the area where i place my things like my futa my lotions my perfumes and all that some fifi makeup at the back it is so cute so beautiful i've just custom made it to fit my own needs and then this is where i place my trousers you can see like it's not color coordinated but it is so beautiful it just makes me choose my outfits very easily and then this is my top areas very cute very cozy very beautiful no color coding or anything but it is so cute and then this is my area for my dresses slash my few few skirts because i don't put on dresses and skirts a lot they're just always there and then now these ones are the miscellaneous things like you know my bed sheets extra bed sheets extra clothes and also extra how are they called pillowcases and stuff like that now from this area where we have this we go to this area now this is my makeup box it is so beautiful i have a makeup business so it is easier for me to store them here and because i don't have much space up on your neck like you too yeah makeup 
and then from there we have these these small small drawers the drawers this one i don't want to show you guys but literally i put my inner wares there and this down one here i put my important books that i don't use them every day for easier storage and just to make my house very pretty so this is just basically it because that is the place i put my clothes this one right here i decided because i don't have any extra storage area or cabinet i decided to put all my gift bags here my bags everything that i just use to carry my stuff so my packages come and i just put them here and if it doesn't like make sense to me i throw them and then of course my handbags right there so it is just basically it carries most of what i need honestly and this is just one of my best decisions ever this closet guys my house used to look like the way it looks but with this one it's made so so much sense i honestly do love that one from my favorite area which is my closet we go to this mirror guys this is a mirror that i honestly do love because when i'm done dressing like choosing my outfits this is where i position myself and look if i'm looking good if i'm fitting the character i'm playing the role you know what i mean it is such a big mirror i just had it made from my place by my carpenter and it is very cute it has two by six mirror it is so tall than i am so that makes me see every detail about myself my body and everything and it's the prettiest thing in this house because during my dressing i just look me and i just keep on telling myself from this mirror you are going to nail it today you're going to do your best today and every motivation that i want to do in my life for that day it starts from this area i look at myself from this mirror and i'm like oh my god you're so pretty you deserve the finest things in life you can do anything so every time i look at myself from this mirror i just tell myself the most inspiring things because i can just envision things from this area of this mirror and also i painted it black because i felt like black looks beautiful in the house for this mirror and honestly chef's kiss i honestly do do love it i encourage you guys to get yourself mirrors even if it's not like a big mirror is this one or bigger than this just get yourself a mirror to ensure during your dressing you look absolutely stunning this mirror adjacent to it we have this table this table is a multi-purpose table guys it is so beautiful before i explain to you why it's a multi-purpose table first of all let's tour it now well this table i bought this how they called grass pampas right but in different colors and it was just like 50 bob and it just makes so much sense and this vase is so beautiful i bought some from stage market as well and next to this one i put my important books on my phones and stuff now these ones are just my notebooks and just motivational books that i really love reading i know you guys have seen these books so many times because i have recommended them so many times atomic habits really helped you with your habits your normal behavior every single day and this mountain is you Honestly, it's a book that I've been reading by Ben Awist, which is so good about self-sabotage because I realize, me as myself, I sabotage a lot of things. My relationships with my friends, my life, my just most of the things. And this one has really been helpful so far. I honestly do love these two books. They're just like good investments, a novel, some just a few, few books and my notebooks and stuff like that. And because this is where I study from, this is why I put my pants, okay, my pants and stuff. This is just like my cup that I, I decided to use it as like my storage for my pants and stuff. And then next to that, I put my laptop there right there. So if I'm watching a movie or I'm studying, it is very ideal. Now, this scented candle, I don't always put them on as often. But once in a while, I put them on. They're so cute, so pretty. This one is the lemon gr grass, I think and yeah they're so pretty they just make everything make sense during that time and guys as i was telling you <laughs> this is a multi-purpose table because this is where i have my breakfast from in the morning all my dinner my my lunch or anything like that i study from here if my friends come when we are talking we are talking from this area like it just does everything it's not dining table or anything it is just this table for studying for everything literally honestly i feel that even in my next space it's going to be better bigger and have different things you know what i mean so this is a study table and at the study table normally i have these two chairs here 
moja ni ya wageni ingine ni yangu <laughs> but now this one i normally put one pillow because i have like many pillows i put one pillow for, just for comfort because you know these are plastic chairs they're not comfortable but i decided to put these ones on let me show you guys the babies <laughs> my babies my babies <laughs> yeah this up i place my babies not like i place them they're just sitting there right now and i'm filming and this just makes so much sense so let me show you what i do normally because you've seen my videos i just come and sit with actual makeup so i sit right here and if i want to use anything i take my laptop and off we go i do my school work i watch movies from here i create content and edit content from here so it's such a lovely space honestly it is so so beautiful i honestly do love it So this, in this area that I've shown you, this is where my carpet is. The carpet is from Isili. It is so beautiful and it's better quality. Yes, I haven't cleaned it in a while, but still it is in a very good state. So it just makes it comfortable. I don't feel cold when I'm studying, putting on my clothes. When I wake up, I can pray from here very comfortably during my prayers. It's very comfortable, very cozy. I honestly do love this area. It's my most loved area of all next to my table i have this fake plant it is so beautiful honestly you saw when i went to buy it from stage market as well it is so cute oh my goodness i honestly love these flowers so much plus it also it's green i would love it to be like the other natural plants but it is artificial i feel like it serves the purpose for now and i put these stones right here because they're so pretty when they're there and also this vase it is very really dirty like manze but it just serves their purpose. This vase with this flower right here, it is so pretty. Honestly, I love it so much. From my deco plant next to it, now we have my shoe rack. Honestly, this shoe rack helps me a lot because my shoes were always, always everywhere. As in, but then this shoe rack really helped me. It's like a eight layer shoe rack, which serves my purpose. I honestly just arrange shoes anyhow. But I can arrange, but I prefer my heels to be up right here, and then are, as as we go down, the more comfortable the shoes become. You know what I mean? <laughs> so this is basically it. It's just so pretty. It is black as well. So a theme that is white, black, orange for me, it's so cute, so pretty. This is very functional to me, very functional because opposite my shoe rack because the space is very limited, guys, and I have to work with what I have. You know what I mean? we have my kitchen area this is just very small and functional just to the point nothing exciting nothing different i have like my vyombo area here i don't have i put them in this mini this basin here my juice blender and everything actually because we are here the juice is here let's add some let's add some more juice that's enough I've just taken a lot of that and then from there we have this place I store stuff it's like end of the year I haven't done shopping for December because I felt like I was going home very soon so there was no need but basically my shopping my small, small shopping so I just put them here yeah just that's basically it with the kitchen area and this is the tap water this is my tap area the water is at least there it's very salty but you know it's it just makes so much sense so that's just basically that area from my kitchen area we have my cooking glass this is where all the magic to do with my body and food and my stomach happens and then from there now we can walk towards my bathroom now these slippers guys these slippers i have used them for years and they're very strong this mat for my bathroom is from italy and then from there now we can come to this area this area is just my toilet track because it couldn't fit inside the toilet inside there i put it here to be more functional so here i also put more of my very feminine self-care stuff like my toilet papers my some essential stuff in this african basket they're so pretty i love them and also my my bathroom uh how they call it grooming stuff right here like my combs my skincare stuff my towels right here i don't know why i have just white towels but this is a girl you know and my towels right here they're so pretty and then down here we have my this is nangoka to stay there and then down here we have this how's it called laundry basket so my laundry basket so before i go to the 
washroom or go to shower i put my dirty laundry right here and my buckets are there so from there now we have my bathroom this house has been so special to me because when i joined campus this is the first place i moved into and have been in this house for four five years actually five years because of covid five years guys this is where i have started businesses i have done my schoolwork from i have tried out things and i have learned a lot in this house i've just seen growth in this house and that is a very special house in my life like my whole campus life guys can you imagine that i'm just done with my school and it's so exciting to me because oh my god when i entered in this house it was just like a room with nothing even this the shelves in the kitchen weren't even there the closet warriors that like i never been used to furnish the house because i felt like not talking to you but like i'm moving out i'm moving out but i never moved out and i realized just for my mental health and sanity and good stuff it's better for me to invest in it than it is and i've honestly made it functional to me custom made it to my own needs and i honestly do love it i'm so grateful to god for the opportunity for me to live in this house and achieve even more and learn a lot from this house it's honestly her whole blessing to me. I am so excited because the next journey is going to be so good, I know for sure. And I'm excited. Thank you so much for coming along with me. So my special place, my place I spend most, most time in, like I spend so much time in this house and I'm so excited. I look pretty in this house. I love myself from this house and I'm excited. Thank you so much for watching. I love you. Have a happy new year. I wish you a very prosperous 2024, full of blessings and achieved goals and dreams. Till the next one, guys. Adios.